Hello folks, we're 14 weeks in and as you can see I've got blistex on my lips because they're so dry. Every time I come home from work, it's blistex time baby. Um, just to show you what I meant, this badger here. Um, yeah, a bit of a low mood, uh, friends are starting to comment on it, um, but it's not hugely bad, maybe, maybe it's... Maybe it's lower than I th thought um, if people are commenting on it, but it's it's not awful. It's not awful. It's just a bit like tired, bored, stressed, 24-7 sort of vibe uh, with breaks of happiness in between. But otherwise, there's no like really horrible intrusive thoughts or anything like that. There's no change in my behaviours or routines, so... I don't know. Anyway, there's that. Um, eyes are dry still. Lips are dry still. I've just had a blood test um, done on this arm. Can't see it because of my sleeves. Um, but hopefully that all comes back fine. I've got another appointment with my dermatologist in just over two weeks. Just over two weeks time. And then we'll review whether I need to continue with it or not. But um, this bad boy's just popped up, like in the past couple of days. So I, I do still get spots, but it's just like, in general, it's become so much better. My chest acne's gotten better as well. That's dying down. Same with the back knee. Um, you can still see redness where the spots were, but... Um, no new spots, which is nice. Um, yeah, so come the dermatologist appointment, I think I want to stick with isotretinoin for a bit longer, maybe till Christmas. It's October right now. Um, the 6th or something or the other. But um, yeah, I think I'll, I'll stick with isotretinoin till Christmas because I just want it all gone. I don't want it to like flare back up again. I don't want to have like a acne relapse or something and go through it all again start to finish so i'd rather just get it done in this first go um but anyway that's my update